Whoa, 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 look at this. We got a boat. We're at the Fox River. Got my boat right here. It is gonna stay parked here for the evening because as you can tell, I'm gonna be taking my buddy Cody's boat out today. He is gonna be guiding. There he is, right up there. Just dropped all my camera gear. What, Cody? Uh, are you gonna guide me to catch a 30 inch today or? Cheers, brother. Yeah, mm -hmm. Nick, we can try. Well, you heard him. We're definitely gonna try to catch a 30 incher today. Will that happen? I don't know. Guess we have to stay tuned to find out. But either way, one thing you can guarantee is that we're gonna get out there and we're gonna catch some walleyes. We got John back there, also looking mighty dapper, I must say. And he is ready to catch some catfish. <laughs> Been on a mean catfish bite lately. So I'm gonna get all my stuff into the boat, get it launched. We're gonna head on out there and hopefully smack the crap out of some walleye. So stay tuned guys, should be a good one. Tight lines from NB Edits. Yeah. That is so cliche. Tight lines. All right, you guys, so we got out on the river and today I'm gonna be throwing something a little bit different. Been using the blade bait the last uh, couple outings and Cody told me, you know, try a rip and wrap. So that's what I'm doing, I'm using a size six rip and wrap. And I know it works because I actually did just catch one, but I am stupid and didn't have my GoPro on. So we're gonna be just casting the flats like we have been the last couple times. Fish are loaded. Cody has already caught a few. John has also already caught a few. And we're just gonna be ripping this rip and wrap and hoping to get a big bite. I know the last couple times I've been out here we've been catching loads of fish but I am looking to get a big girl. Hooked up. First fish. Uh, no. Yeah, but he ate. He munched. He did. First fish on the ripping raft. Not, a, not the target species. Because if I turn around here quick. Dandy looking fish. Cody's hooked up on the label. Look at that. That thing absolutely clapped it. I did switch colors, ripping wraps. But this one, uh, this one ate. I cannot actually believe that this size of fish ate that. I'm supposed to be targeting bigger ones, but this is one of the most fun lures to actually catch fish on. And we couldn't see it. It was like that ate. That ate. Another fish. I actually felt him pick that up. Did you? Yeah. Oh boy, this is fun. Catching them on the big rattle baits. Not a very big one either, but like, God, they, he hit it. I felt him actually pick that up. Just boat flip him. Probably should have netted him, but it is what it is. tell they just he really wanted that didn't pin it to the bottom but nice male walleye we got a decent school behind the boat here I'm gonna keep on trying to pick them off eventually hopefully uh, we get the right size there are a lot of big females that pushed up now that they opened up the dam So we're just gonna keep on grinding it out. Isn't that right, John Lehman? Yep, just like how I grind out Grinder, my favorite app on the app store. <laughs> oh, John's with the up. Oh my gosh. Yes. I'm crazy. Let's go, John. I'm crazy. John, do you need a net? Big one? I don't. How big? 30? Uh, I'm gonna say this is a good 17, 17 inch or so. Let's see where we have them. I love catching walleyes, guys. I really do. You know, I'm freezing my little pune saw. <laughs> this one is running. Like, it's, I'm, I don't even, oh, fair enough. I need to switch. 
Why did he run away over here? Why did he run over here? Because he's 18 inches. You made him nervous. I did make him nervous. Oh, it's in the mouth. <laughs> Let's go. Don't worry, don't worry. I got it. Oh, my friend Nick got him. Play him. Play him. <laughs> That's my friend Nick got him. Plum color, baby. Oh, what a confidence bait that is. Did he eat? It does feel big. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to nut this. Looks pretty big. You want me to net it down here or up there? What? Oh yeah, that's that's big. Oh, Cody has a big fish. This is good. This is good. Come on, you got it. You got it. Oh, that's a tank, dude. Dude, this is you versus the guy who throws you down to Dude, that's a tank, Cody. Let's go, brother. Let's go, brother. Rip and wrap. I'm just gonna take my GoPro off and they'll start biting. Or that one will bite. In another area. Oh, yeah. First rip. Uh, not really. Is you recording? I am. It'd be funny listening to you say, I might as well just turn my GoPro off and you catch one. Where'd you catch that one, Nick? Uh, uh, on the other side of the river. Right there? Yep. Yeah, about, probably. About there. That's not bad. He ate. He did. Yeah. We'll take him like that. Oh my god. Nice. Well, it's only been about four hours since I've caught a fish, but I managed to finally get one in the boat. Not sure why this guy is eating the rip and wrap. Supposed to be catching bigger ones, like Cody caught a 26. I would like one of those, but I guess he's a guide and I am not, so that's probably Maybe why. can't be choosy. <laughs> it has nothing to do with anything. That's probably why he caught that fish and I didn't. So, we're gonna get her back out there and try to catch another. Dude, you caught that. Ooh. That sounded good. On the drop, fellas. That sounded good, John. I sharp shot that one. I was like, ooh, you're 35 feet this way. He does. That's huge. Oh, I'm on also. Oh. Doubled. John and I are doubled right now. The school yeah. shall be over there. Yep. He shall triple up. How big is yours, John? That would be something. No. To triple? No. John's just got another mayo on. Mine is about the same size as his. Actually, his is bigger. That makes, that makes sense. Oh. <laughs> well, here we are using a rip and wrap, catching small males, and John is using a blade and catching bigger fish than I am. So, here's my fish. There's John's fish. This is you versus the guy who tells you not to worry about next. Is that what they say? Let's see here. Yeah, nice. that's nice. about right. So the key in catching these fish with the rip and wrap is you got to cast it as far as you possibly can. Give it one hop and there should be a fish. If there isn't, then you might as well reel it in because that's the only time they've ever hit it feels like. Well, figured I'd bring out the big camera. Hello everybody, my name is John Lehman. I've been out fishing with Nick and Cody today and I have a fish on right now. Ate me on the drop. I'm not as cool as these guys, I'm using a blade bait. Oh, that's a oh, nice oh you probably shall grab the net. That's kind of nice. It's actually I'm decent. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
Hey. That's a nice one. That is a nice one. My arm is just freaking wrapped after that. That's a good one. Bro. Oh, yeah. That's, yeah, that's pretty nice. Probably like a 22 incher. Really fat. Check out the growths on it, though. Ugh, looks nasty. That's fine. I'll get a nice fish. Thank you, man. Ooh, flex. John, nice brother. Bubble. Tight lines, baby, from NB Edits. Well, I'm glad my friends can catch all the big fish today because I cannot. I'm using a rip and wrap, thinking I would only target big fish today. And uh, yeah, John's been using the blade and he just caught a nice one. Cody is using the rip and wrap and caught like 225 plus already today. I don't know, we still got a little bit of time, so my time could be any minute, I guess. We are on a big school again, so get back in there and hope we catch some more. Well, John, if you had a couple words to say about today, how'd you feel about it? It was cold and it was a grind, but like we got ours, you know, Cody caught some nice fish. I probably caught like, I honestly probably caught like 15, 15 fish or so, Nick. That's not bad. Yeah, it wasn't bad, but I was using a blade bait the whole time. Nick tried making a different type of video for you guys. So he was using a bigger profile bait. Um, just that bite really wasn't there yet. He got a couple, but give it a couple weeks. Yeah, the cold water has definitely uh, turned off some fish, but I have been using the blade bait the last couple of videos. So I did want to shake it up and try something a little new. I know a lot of people do throw the rip and wraps with the water temp today, it was 35. So it is a little cold. Usually I like to use rip and wraps once that water gets somewhere around 40, 41, 42 is usually when you get those bigger females and more likely to get a, a bigger bite. So a little early, but wanted to try it. We did get bit on it. Um, it was it was definitely a rough day. I mean, the weather wasn't that nice today either. I mean, it was one of the better days, but it, I think it was only like a high of 37 today. So not ideal, but we got it done. Hopefully you guys still enjoyed watching a few hookups on the bigger rattle baits. Nick and I are about to have ourselves a great rest of the night though. We're gonna get Taco John's and then play some Call of Duty control drops, baby. Yeah, which we did do a list uh, on the boat actually yesterday talking about our top three favorite things in life um i don't know if i should say these because i know my wife watches but one of them is for sure taco john's the other one is call of duty i'll leave the last couple out so you know i don't well, get no one of them was no wind any, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, any no day wind. with no, no wind, wind is like awesome i know john is from you know over in the dakotas so wind to him is like brutal yeah. so like yeah wind sucks any day without wind is a beautiful day but yeah, we got we got a hot tub, we got Taco John's, and we have Call of Duty waiting for us as soon as we get home. So we got a little bit of a drive, so we're going to get on out of here, get the rest of our night kicked off. I do have off all week, so I am trying to get as many videos as I can um, with the weather and everything. I'm still going to be out here. We're still going to be grinding trying to get as much content as possible for you guys so again hopefully you guys enjoyed if you like this one please make sure to give it a like make sure go check out john's channel he filmed what did you film today actually i filmed the uncut video so you have to subscribe to uncut to okay watch it. yeah you gotta subscribe to uncut yeah. to actually watch it but our buddy cody who took us out he already left because he had some important meeting stuff to get done but he filmed the video if you guys want to check out any of their stuff it'll be down in the description Again, we're going to get on out of here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I will catch you on the next one. Tight lines from NB Edits.